It's the Daily Comedy News with your host, Mark Pyers. Join us for breaking headlines and all kinds of comedy shenanigans. Brought to you by the Beat Seat. Oh, my friends. Welcome. Welcome to the longest running daily variety show, The Mark Inspire Show Day. 1914 in a row, we got an action packed comedy news lined up for you today. Danny Masterson, prison boss? I gotta hear about this one. We're getting right into it. This is the way the show is gonna roll from now on. We're not gonna have this long, drawn out intro. We're getting right into the news, especially since I'm on late today after 10 o'clock. Welcome, welcome to the Mark Inspire Show. Danny Masterson, using that 70s show fame and Scientology to advantage in prison. Let's let's see what this means. Is he a prison boss? Is Danny Masterson prison boss from The Wire? I'm thinking he's in like the, the Wire. They're gonna actually this is the entire thing's a charade. It's just some show they're they're shooting. And they're gonna come out in a few years and be like, guys, we're just kidding. You know, nobody there was actually no real evidence. This is just a movie. We shot 37 seasons. Imagine he gets out in like 30 years and like we shot the whole thing. We shot it all. We're releasing it as a series now. The Danny Masterson in prison for being a scumbag series. Pick it up. You get it at Target. They're giving it away, literally. They just don't, nobody wants it. Anyway, let's see what this creeper's up to. On March 13th, Danny Masterson celebrated his 48th birthday. Behind bars, you know, where he should be. Hopefully getting bangarooed by some guy named Hector. Uh, the California Men's Colony in St. Louis, Obispo, California. Days later, his estranged wife, Bijou Phillips, you guys know her, she was spotted visiting the convicted rapist. I don't know what we can say online. How about we say the convicted scumbag uh, for the first time, along with their 10 year old daughter, Fiona. Fiana? Fiana? Fiana. What the hell is that? What kind of name is Fiana? It's either Anna, it's Fiona. But it's not Fianna. Like, who goes with Fianna? It's all these people in Hollywood, right? They're like, a oh, fee. Fee what? Fiona? No, Fianna. Oh, really? You're doing one of those? Oof, you know? But her name's Bijou. Guys, comedy news. We get into it, okay? Hopefully, you guys can stick with me for the next couple minutes. We're getting into a few stories. We have the Diddy and Usher update. Usher's coming out. He's talking about Diddy. I want to hear what's going on. Joanne, are you excited? Joanne, stop wheezing back there. Guys, YouTube X or Rumble, if you want to see Joanne, you want to see this news story over my shoulder, that's how we do it here. So, say hello if you're out there. This is a daily variety show every single day, 9 a.m. and then after 10 p.m. Eastern Standard. And we do the news, we play music on the guitar. While Bijou Phillips was looking grim as she entered the prison, sources exclusively tell the in-touch Danny has been using his fame to ease his way at minimum security facility. Matt Sebron, she can hit us with a woo-hoo. Get us started here in the comedy news. That was a good one, Zabrosk. Oh, good. It's every day. Every day, Matt Zabrowski hits you with a woo-woo. Just lift you up a level. You know what I mean? Uh, so Danny's popular celebrity in prison. He's, you know, people want to hang out with Danny. Hey, we don't care that you're a piece of garbage, scumbag, piece of S. You know what I mean? We want to chill with you. We love those locks. You know, can you tell us a little more about Scientology? What's Tom Cruise like? You know? Danny's, uh, you know, explains that inmates know him from the 70s show. He's using the teachings of Scientology to his advantage. What is he doing? He's a longtime Scientologist. He's learned the ways of manipulation. You know, I can, you know, be a scumbag here in prison, you know? And he does, you know, the Star Wars mind trick. The word is that people are protecting him there. The guards are good to him. He's putting together his own squad. I told you guys, he's a boss in, in prison. It's no good. He'll need it. He's been sentenced to 30 years to life. Guys, you know, plenty of people want to shank him, but now he's got protection. You know, when you become a boss, right, Jim? Your name's 
scumbag Danny Masterson. Anyway, what else do we got in the news today? Usher says he witnessed pretty wild stuff while living at Diddy's mansion when he was only 14. What the fuck was he doing there at 14? Please hit the like on the way out the door, leave a comment and share. I'm live at 9 a.m. and after 9 p.m., so join us. This is the Mark Inspire Show.